What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pillion here, your YouTube world Harris champion here, here on YouTube, and I'm coming at you to my WWE NXT Takeover review from last night from Orlando, Florida. So here's my NXT Takeover review from Orlando, Florida, for April 1st, 2017. That's right. Let's get things going, shall we? We kicked off WWE NXT Takeover with you know like Triple H welcoming everybody into the building, saying that we are NXT and stuff like that. So then we kicked off the first First match, and that was with, and that was Sanity versus 10, 10, 10, Ty Dillinger, Ruby Riot, um, Roderick Strong, and it was supposed to be No Way Jose, but, um, apparently he got hurt at Axis, and got jumped by Sandy, but, so then, um, so his replacement was, uh, I'm so horrible with names. It's not even funny. Uh, Cassia. Oh no, whatever his name is. Oh no. So, and apparently the winner of that match was Sanity. So they picked up the win, and that match was phenomenal and fantastic. They tore the roof down of this one. So the second match we had on NXT Takeover was Cien Andre Alamis versus Alister Alaster. Black, and the winner of the match was Alista Black, and this guy is going to be phenomenal. This guy is just fantastic in the ring. This guy was just great, great performer, great match by them two. They just delivered and tore the house down. This one, now this one, now the third match we had was an NXT Tag Team Championship match, and it was a three-way elimination one. We had the Authors of Pain versus DIY versus. The Revival, and this match was just great from the very start. We had DIY, we had the Altars of Pain, we had the Revival, and the DIY and the Revival worked together on the Altars of Pain, took the Altars of Pain out, but then DIY gets eliminated and the crowd's going bullshit, bullshit, so the crowd's just bullshitting on it, and I just loved it, and then the Altars of Pain's retained their... NXT Tag Team Titles, and they are the winners of the match, and they they pin the Revival to retain their NXT Tag Team Champion. So, and by the way, those belts are new now. The NXT Tag Team Championship belts are new, like new designs. They look fantastic, awesome. So now we move on to the next match we had on NXT Takeover Boys, an NXT Women's Title Match: Ember Moon versus. Asuka. And the winner was, and still NXT Women's Champion, Asuka. That's right, so now, because she pushed the referee into Ember Moon when she was on top of the turnbuckle, and that's what took place. So, Ember Moon did not get the NXT Women's title, but I see, I, I think around summertime, Ember Moon will beat Asuka, and Asuka will get the call up, but, you know, around summer, so, you know, it, it just goes funny with that way, how did it be work, so... Asuka will eventually lose that belt. Don't you worry. So, uh... And plus, the NXT Women's title is new also, too. Now, before we get on to the main event, uh, they pan on to Drew McIntyre, who was sitting in the crowd, which means that he could be making an NXT call-up and making his appearance on maybe this Wednesday's NXT, so you just never know what to expect, because Drew McIntyre was sitting right in the crowd. Now, the main event we had in NXT TakeOver was an NXT Championship match. Shinsuke Nakamura versus Bobby Roode. Glorious. And that, and he also got a new belt too. So, therefore, they showed up the new belt. And the winner was, and still, NXT Champion Bobby Roode. And this match was just glorious. From the very start, from the very beginning, they tore the house down, man. Have to applaud these two right there, man. Kept kicking out of each and every one of their moves. You never knew who was going to win this match. You never even thought who was going to win. It was just phenomenal, awesome, fantastic finish. I'm happy Bobby Roode won because he just deserves it, and I'm just so happy. And this WrestleMania week is starting to go off pretty well. And we got WrestleMania tonight. That's right. We got WrestleMania tonight. Can't wait to watch it tonight. It's going to be something whew, exciting and fun. And I hope you all enjoy WrestleMania tonight. And 
I got my Seth Rollins shirt on for him to beat Triple H and Ooh, this WrestleMania week started pretty pretty good. And I don't know if y'all heard this too. This is not NXT related, but the Young Bucks just beat the Hardys last night for the Irish Tag Team Tell. So could we be seeing the Hardys at WrestleMania tonight? You never know. But anyway, please like this video, leave your comment down below, and subscribe for more. You're all the best of John Squad. You're all one of a kind. I love each and every one of y'all. And you're all the champions in my heart. And I love each and every one of y'all. And thank you for joining me here on my NXT TakeOver review. I hope y'all enjoyed it. And that's about it. So peace out the John Squad. Enjoy WrestleMania tonight.